Okay, I hate to sound like a crazy conspiracy theorist, but is it just me or does somebody else feel like, you know, something's up all of a sudden, Castro's not in office, there's a deal going on between the United States and Cuba, not a doctor, I'm a demijohn. yes, he is a doctor with a real PhD, since he's no longer in office now, Iran is giving up all this nuke information, there's like a deal going on between Iran and the U.S., like, for starters, I, I, I am partial Cuban, so I can speak on the Cuban people. And Castro is definitely not as bad as the, the government portray him to be. For those I forgot, back when uh, we got hit by Katrina, he, he offered assistance and Bush denied it. He had ships ready with supplies, ready to aid the United States citizens. But Bush said, no, we don't want your assistance. We're the United States government. We run everything. But yeah, man, um, like this shit right now, Obama's actually um, going through the proper protocol to make a deal with somebody. Normally, he just say, fuck it, he's going to send NATO and, and bomb your country. Something's up, because now he's like, he got to go, you know, consult with fucking uh, Israel and Saudi Arabia, who are the biggest crooks out there in the Middle East, about this, this negotiation deal with, with Iran. Like, something's up with this shit. But unlike Putin... You fucking with a nigga that will use the nukes, you dig? So go ahead and keep trying to be the bully of the world, United States. Keep policing the world. Shit, blowback is very fucking real. Like, we gotta turn off the motherfucking media because everybody is, is, is always focusing on what's on television. While y'all motherfuckers focus on the Trayvon Martin shit, with motherfucker Bradley Mann was being a, 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 a sentenced for a nonviolent crime. Like, this, this shit is, is getting out of hand. Don't forget that. Hit that, that subscribe button. I'll let your boy. Yeah.